the Clippers came out for their opening warm-ups. Paul George gets inside on the finish. And have done. He's more active, more athletic, more nimble. A second shot and then a tip out already. Paul George throws the jumper. Terrific defensively all season. Reggie Jackson for three. Boy, he had an unbelievable performance in game six on Friday night. Just tremendous. Again, a quick turnaround. Ayton gets it inside, and DeAndre Ayton, a couple of buckets. Mark falling away shot, rolls off the rim. He falls down, thought he got hit. Payne comes the other way. Payne the drive, right-handed, lays it up and in. The left was fascinating to watch because he did it from close to the rim as Booker gets a nice roll. This has Booker on him, high advantage for Marcus Morris here. Gets in the paint and gets the roll. Now proud of the drive and the finish. After an emotional and tough series against Utah from Friday night to Sunday afternoon as Paul George trills that one. Come with a late double team on Booker. Good cut by Bridges into the heart of the defense, but he was indecisive on his shot. Morris gets inside, goes back door. Tough, smart, versatile guy. Cross court pass. Batum couldn't get it, and Crowder makes some pay. And now Put a big body on Booker. Morris has picked him up now. George Booker finds an open space, knocks down the three. Zubox, a lot of contact there. Four on the 24. Paul George from long distance. Oh, he's a big time talent. Comes Booker. Bad pass stolen by Beverly. Beverly goes right to the rim and finishes. Patrick Beverly, excellent. Teams become different when they lose their main star player. And sometimes that's difficult for an opponent, isn't it? Well, campaign, I mean, Cameron Johnson made that first.